So I've been working on a project the majority of this year, and I really haven't talked about it much on social media, but now it's getting towards the end where I guess I would talk about it to let everyone know what I've been working on. Uh, and I could actually use your help if you are interested in uh, taking part in this website. So it is a post-production community. I'll quickly jump over to my screen. And this is where we can share and connect with other post-production artists. So if you ever need help with something, uh, this is the idea behind this is this would be the place to get insights on how to do something as well as if you need it to get someone to do something specific, you could come here to find them uh, for whatever that thing is. So let's say you're working on a commercial and you need it to get uh, some type of motion graphics artist, you could come here. Or if you need it to get a colorist, you could come here and be able to connect with them through this. Kind of think of it like the uh, LinkedIn of post-production. With a lot of sites that are similar like this when it comes to professional networking, they really don't have any way easy for us to showcase uh, our work. And there are a couple of other websites out there that allow you to showcase work, but they're not specific to post-production. So I can't go to one website to find a Foley guy, to find a colorist, to find uh, um, motion artists, a motion graphics artist that deals with animation, uh, to find an editor, colorist, whatever it may be, to bring a final motion picture to life, if it's a commercial uh, YouTube video, whatever it may be. So that's why I decided to make this. So there's a couple of different portions to that that we need to get, right? So we need uh, a community aspect, a way for us to interact and share stuff and uh, communicate and uh, that whole thing. Then we need a way, because this is a post-production community, to show our work, to actually showcase our work, almost like a portfolio. Um, and so that's what I've built uh, over the majority of this year. So this is the website. Um, we have the ability to add in our projects. So I can come over here and here is our editor. I'm just going to quickly go into this because what I'm looking for uh, currently is I want people that have post-production projects currently done uh, and that they have some type of portfolio or they just want to showcase their work. I want them to mess around with this editor and uh, set up a project. And if you have any problems to let me know, because I feel like this is pretty much squared away. I just need more people to interact with it so that I get a better uh, a pool of people to um, you know, find any bugs that there might be. But I think it's pretty much bug free at this point. So uh, I took the liberties of making this almost look like the DaVinci Resolve editor. I know that the majority of people on um, or excuse me, not the DaVinci Resolve editor, the DaVinci Resolve uh, project manager. Uh, it looks a lot like it. So uh, I have a couple of different projects in here. Anything that's private obviously isn't shown on the site. I currently have this one shown and I can quickly go in it and show you. So this is my project. I just have a couple of different images here. Okay, I have one image and one video. If I wanted to change the order of these, I could simply click and go like that to change the order. Also have the ability to move these around. So it's pretty much a block editor. Um, and there's a bunch of other little things in here. Like we can come into here and we can check uh, the different tools that we use, categories, that sort of thing. Uh, and then once we have this saved, it shows up on uh, the website in a couple of different places. But I can quickly show you uh, on my profile, they would show up here. And I can show you over here. Uh, this gentleman's profile, you can see his projects that he currently has. And the idea here is that we would have a ton of different projects here. And then you could easily go over to the profile and see all the different work experience and stuff like that. So that if we never needed someone, we could easily get them because uh, we could look through this whole thing and then message them and see if they work. You know, it's kind of like one big directory of artists. That's the idea. Uh, additionally, we need some aspect of networking. So we can go in and we can create different groups. I made a DaVinci Resolve group that we've been chatting in. And in here, uh, you know, just like any other place online where we could interact about whatever the subject is or, or um, 
category that that particular group is about or whatever little uh, niche that you want to have a group about that has to do with post-production. Um, so yeah, the website, anyone can go to it at this point and add your projects to it, interact with other people on the platform. My biggest uh, thing that I'm looking for now are for people to add their projects on there and uh, let me know if you see any bugs or if there's anything that you think uh, should be added when it comes to functionality. Oh, one little thing here, I guess I should show you here quickly. In the editor itself, if you need, there's a little uh, quick start uh, guide that it shows you at the beginning, but if you do need additional uh, help, you could click on these three little dots and go into help. And then in here, if I click on it, I have a whole video and uh, different things talking about how to use the editor so that you get the most out of it. And that really, uh, uh, there's a couple of features that are kind of hidden uh, in other settings. So uh, I just wanted to show you that and how to get to it. So yeah, that's what I've been working on. I don't know if I would call this a launch or if I'm just looking for more people to help uh, beta test the, the website. But uh, yeah, this is what I've been working on. Other thing too, I guess I could say, if you scroll down here, there is a contact us. You could go there to to let me know about the different bugs. In the editor, there is a, an area to uh, uh, file a bug report if there is an error or um, a thing there. But the majority of the site works just like any other social media. But uh, yeah, that's the website I've been working on. I hope you guys take a look at it. It's all free to use and connect with me on there and, and, and link up and let me know. But uh, with that being said, I think that's kind of it at this point. I'm still kind of, I feel like I'm rusty and making videos now. It's been, been a couple months. But uh, yeah, I'm back. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching. Until the next one, guys. Cheers. Peace.